Let's take the tunnel first. I'll, I'll always respawn back at the the Eden Chapel copy, so shouldn't be too hard to try the other route when I'm done here. What the hell is that down there? Is that a blood river? Oh, and those ugly spiders. There's that bell again. Uh, holy shit! So there's some a turret of some kind firing shit. Holy! Am I safe here? Yeah. Um. Oh, there's one on the side as well. Oh, oh, oh. oh, there's a pressure plate, that's why. Oh, they are standing on me. Oh, fuck off. Oh, it hits him as well. Holy shit. That was clever. By letting them stand on the on the pressure plates. So they're still always activated by those pressure plates. So I should watch out where I place my feet. They look fucking scary. Wow, hammer attack, he says. Blood! Yeah, blood. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude, get a life. And down they go. So there's light in that tower, don't Ooh, look at that. I didn't even notice that yet. There's some weird kind of... Is that supposed to be a blood moon? Or... This one's dead, this one's dead. Oh wow, funny. This is one of the buildings from the beginning. With almost the same enemy placement. Except there's not one here, it's dead. Delayed Molotov. But A special hunter tool crafted by the old Oto workshop. These Molotovs wedge into the ground when thrown and explode on a time delay. A shame that such a complex gadget must be sacrificed with each use of this inefficient hunter tool. Nevertheless, delayed Molotovs are cherished by the minority of hunters who prefer the Trixier skill. Trixier kill, that was it. This creation is one of the earliest known roots of the powder kegs. So are we gonna find more powder kegs then? You know, the explosive uh, funny guys. So this looks, looks like some place I do not want to be yet. So let's check out the stairs first. Wow. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> oh, fuck you. I knew something like that was going to happen. <laughs> oh, they're relying on the fact that you know how these levels work. Damn it. 
I'm watching. I'm not gonna assume anything right now. Doesn't seem to be anything. No booby tra booby traps. So is there a lantern here or gonna or are they gonna fuck with me here as well? Oh yeah, fuck off. A beast mode hunter, seriously? Ah fuck, I still have my torch out. That was a problem. Get out, get out, wherever you are. Fucking hell. If he does that, and his back is turned towards me, it's a prime opportunity for a visceral attack. He's tough, man. What's he doing? goes again. He's almost down. Oh, and he loses his fur immediately. Firing hammer badge. So was that the actual irreverent Izzy? Guess we'll see in a second. Firing hammer badge of the old Otto workshop. Badge crafted by the Otto workshop precursor to the workshop of the heretical powder kegs. The powder kegs were driven by singular ideas and crafted strange weapons of great intricacy. It is clear that the philosophy of the powder kegs was already established at this time. That doesn't really give me any more information. But it says in the description of the beast claws that there was an irreverent Izzy that used this weapon. So now what, can I continue? Can't. So he was just here for the patch. Okay, then no lantern as well. So, God damn it! So is this pretty much a dead end then? Forcing me towards the scary place, the bloody river. Oh, I hate those fucking spiders. Not that they're fucking, but... There's a lot of them. There's a door there. Um... That one's interested. Okay then. Holy shit! Okay, they didn't do that before.
That's one. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. I need to divide and conquer this. Oh, there's four! And two still on... Oh, three still on this side. Holy shit! Okay, never mind. Seriously? Um... Is that spider coming up? Yeah. So those guys are assholes. Doesn't seem to be able to hit me here. No oh, defenses in the way. Get eaten up by spiders, bitch. Eat him. Eat him. So he can't hit me, so that's... Give me something else. The spiders are very interested. Lots of flashy noises. Ooh. Oh, fuck off. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Fuck. Leave the lock on. Ooh, this sneaky bastard. Okay. So are they gonna come back? Or? Oh my god, all those directions. All those directions. Seriously, what the fuck? Constables gloves. Once upon a time, a troop of foreign constables chased the beast all the way to Yarnum, and this is what they wore. The constables became victims of the beast, except for one survivor, who in turn devoured the creature whole, all by himself. Gross. This fabulous favorite among Yarnumites, who are partial, partial to any stories of pompous, intolerant foreigners who suffer for their ignorance, it makes the blood taste that much sweeter. And I also shoot with this one. Made of brass to protect their weapon bearing hands. That's cool. Equip that one. At the time, some hunters believed that certain metals would ward off beast's blood. On the night of the hunt, it is no wonder that some resort to superstition. <laughs> so, brass doesn't work against beast, apparently. Hmm. So, that was just for the item. I wonder if the spiders also are just here for added protection for something. Come join me! Ooh, ooh.
they seem to be kind of devoid of their most annoying attack. Why are they moving so weird? Oh, so now you start humping? Sploosh. That pack is dead. And the wall will have known it. Another four. Bloody river. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Running out of everything. Vulnerable from the sides, too. A lot more than their Kinghurst Castle counterparts. Oh, there's another scurry beast! Okay. Holy shit! Yeah, there's a minigun. Far, buddy. Oh, wow. <sighs> oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, all that work with the fucking spiders. God damn you.
not so much surprised by the fact that I died, but more... He sometimes does it. Okay. Got that one. Bloodborne, still not a game you play for two hours straight without dying a lot. And becoming worse at the game. Thousand nine hundred blood echoes restored. And how much running can I get away in here? Guy's still alive. So now we get to the minigun part again. Ah, they're using those mortals. And tore with his high hat. Wielded his mighty fire hammer. Okay. Man, I'm doing worse. Oh, fuck off. Hunter guys really make it hard. Oh great! Hi. But it's funny how they make that little ticking noise. So back to the spiders then, I presume. And that's my health back. So I wonder, is this guy back? No, he's not. And there's still nothing here. So now then, the spiders. I think I can largely ignore the spiders. Oh, 
that's one. Oh, that makes it, well, easier. On God. And you die. So. Spiders are getting their free call again. So we got another tunnel over there as well. And we've got this place. So let's try this for a change. Are those pressure paints? There's one dude over there. Friendly? You're a hunter with your sanity, aren't you? Must have taken a wrong turn then, eh? Well, we're more alike than you think. This is the hunter's nightmare. Where hunters end up when drunk with blood. You've seen them before. Aimless, wandering hunters slavering like beasts. This is what the poor fools have to look forward to. So, don't be brash. Turn back before it's too late. Unless you've something of an interest in nightmares. You could say that. Oh yes, I see. You sense a secret within the nightmare and cannot bear to leave it be. As if the spirit of Bergenworth lives on within you. Such inquisitive hunters will relish the nightmare. But beware. Secrets are secrets for a reason, and some do not wish to see them uncovered. Especially when the secrets are particularly unseemly. That was a lot of saying nothing. Beware. Secrets are especially... Okay. Hi. Thinking man. Why does this look like a door I don't want to open? Oh, we're back! Oh, for fuck's sake! God damn it! I was so close! <laughs> okay. So that's another shortcut. Hmm. Maybe I should end it here then. On this lovely view. So thank you guys for watching. If you want to see my complete playthrough of the vanilla Bloodborne. You can check it uh, right here on my channel as well. Uh, so that's youtube.com slash trophynut place. With trophynut as T-R-E-O-V-N-U-T and in place. Uh, and you can also find me on Twitter uh, under at trophynut. So thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video. And if you like this video, please click like. And for more, subscribe. So, goodbye.